Hi boys and girls! Alright, we are going to make some paint today, some watercolor paint. And all you need is water and food coloring. And um, you can use Q-tips to paint with. So I have this little dish, and you can use anything. You can use little different cups, um, whatever you happen to have around the house. I'm going to go ahead and fill each little thing with water. Just a little water. Okay. Then I'm going to do my primary colors first. I'm going to start with my yellow food coloring. I'm going to put just a drop. And then I'm going to go for my blue food coloring. Put just a drop. These are my primary colors. And then I'm going to go for my red food coloring and just put a drop. Now I want to do these three colors, my secondary colors. So you know what, I want to mix probably blue and red here. So blue and red. And then why not blue and yellow there. So blue and yellow. And then I want to do yellow and red there. Yellow and red. And then, even though I used only three colors, I can get six colors. So one, two, three, four, five, six Q-tips. All right, so I'm gonna kinda mix these together and look, it looks like it makes a green. Blue and red together looks like it makes a real dark blackish purple. Probably put a little too much in there. This is just blue looking. Ooh, looks kind of reddish orange. You can play around with the different colors, boys and girls, until you get the shade exactly that you want. Maybe put a little drop more of one or another color. So let's see what it looks like on paper. Here's my paper. We're going to start with the yellow. This should be a red because I think it was just pure red. And blue. These are my primary colors. And this here is my yellow and red. Well, that looks more orangey, huh? Oh, that should be orange, yellow and red. Okay, so this is red, primary red. This is secondary yellow and orange. Hopefully, this is kind of a darky color, but that's okay. Because red and blue usually make purple. It may dry looking more purple than black. And then green. So there you have it, boys and girls. That's how you get a lot more different colors out of just three uh, food coloring, mixing it just with water. And there you go. You have some paint at home to paint with. Thank you so much, boys and girls. Happy painting.